and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So it has been absolutely ages since I have done a sit down video but I'm going to be doing so many more of these so please hit subscribe if you can that would be absolutely amazing and stay tuned because I've got so many good exciting videos coming I literally cannot wait to put them all out there so yes please hit subscribe so go and grab a cup of tea go and get cozy I've got my cozy jumper on go and grab a blanket your cozies pop a candle on and just sit down and let's get all Christmassy and write our Christmas lists for others and ourselves so what I'm actually going to be doing is I'm going to be listing off items that I would like myself and also that I want to gift for others and also some other ideas that I have for gifts um, just to help out you guys and help out somebody else who's really struggling for Christmas gifts because I know that this year is so difficult because we can't browse in the shops which is my when I go shopping for Christmas I'm always in the shops having a look and then I'm like oh my god yeah that's such a good idea when I'm like going through like the different floors and the different sections so I'm definitely finding it more difficult so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put up some items um, around here and the pictures of what I'm talking about and prices to kind of give you a rough guide so this is this kind of Christmas haul isn't going to be anything over £200 at all per item it's going to be a um, lower item I'm definitely Definitely going to be doing high gift presents for big presents and also stocking fillers as well so let's just jump straight into it okay so the first thing I'm actually going to be starting out with is actually a perfume so I feel like perfume is such a lovely gift for a lady um, I think it's so nice for men and women it's always a really nice gift and it also can be like a really expensive gift it could be the main present for somebody for example for me for Christmas I've actually asked for um, the Tiffany perfume but when I was actually looking into the Tiffany perfume they do these kind of deals and this is why I thought this would be such an amazing gift so sometimes they do say if someone's favorite perfume is Lady Million sometimes they actually do like limited edition versions of the perfume so I actually have asked for Tiffany Love so I'm gonna put it up around here so it's the same as Tiffany but it's just a little bit of a different tweaked smell compared to the normal um, perfume and I feel like so many different brands would be doing limited edition versions and Christmas gift sets which is so amazing. I know that Debenhams are doing amazing gift sets of perfume and so are House of Fraser. Debenhams definitely have a look because the Tiffany Love perfume is only sold in Debenhams and obviously that is a um, limited edition one but also John Lewis as well. So there are so many places as well and you can definitely look online but a perfume would be 100% a really really good gift for um, a main present or even they do some really luxury perfumes for really low price. Perfume is definitely definitely a good gift to buy. You can also get perfumes that are cheaper for example Victoria spray, Victoria Secret sprays or Hollister sprays which are always a signature in a girl's handbag. I also know a really really good spray that I always get so many compliments on. If you really really like a sweet sweet smell or somebody likes a really sweet smell, Snow Fairy spray two squirts last you all day like and I've never had so many compliments when I have on that so snow fairy spray so that is another one and that one is around 20 pounds so I'll pop it up here it's kind of, of an ugly bottle but for maybe a stocking filler if that's one of the big presents in the stocking or even for underneath the tree I think it's just a great addition and also a perfume smell which is amazing they also do um last do loads of different sprays and they actually do have Christmas sprays as well the definitely 100% recommend perfume as a gift for somebody and definitely look out for those different scents and the different limited edition versions so that is one of the things on my Christmas wish list. Another thing that I really think this year is going to be a big big hit is skincare. I don't know if it's just me but usually I never bothered with any skincare but recently I'm absolutely loving it. So the Ordinary brand is really cheap and affordable. Bottles are like five 
five pounds, three pounds for really, really, really good high quality skincare. Um, I highly recommend it. I am actually, I've asked for it for myself. I've actually got it for other people for Christmas as well. So I definitely 100% recommend. Things like the hydrochloric acid is absolutely amazing because it just moisturizes the skin and makes it nice and plump. For acne prone skin, the nymocide and zinc, I think if that's how you say it, um, yeah, 100% recommend them. Also the pills, um, the AB, I think it's AHB, ABH um, one, that is some amazing things from The Ordinary that are only like five pounds. They are small little bottles, but they are definitely amazing. If you wanted to do like a skincare hamper, that would be so lovely with just a few items in there which you could actually get quite a few items in for quite low price, which I think is so amazing. Also on the skincare brand, you can also get things from Sierra V, like moisturizers for nighttime and PM. Obviously you could go really high end and get the Charlotte Tilbury, which is like 80 pounds, but for a really, really, really good version, which actually doctors recommend, Sierra V would be so good. Also another um, area on the skincare would be kind of cleansers um, to take off makeup, makeup and things like that. Another really amazing brand is the La Rose Posse, 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 I'm not, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, but they have some amazing cleansers. Um, I'll put some pictures up here and they have some amazing cleansers and um, beautiful skincare as well. So it's just another luxury item. If you are say getting um, some makeup, so like some makeup palettes, alongside that getting the cleanser is just such an extra little surprise that I think people would be so appreciative of because you think about putting on the makeup but you don't think about taking it off so I think that is such a lovely gift. So makeup, I think makeup is such a big hit. I definitely think you could do things like get luxury foundations like Charlotte Tilbury um, or NARS or some really really lovely foundation but obviously it's quite difficult as you don't know what skin type they are but eyeshadow palettes are definitely definitely a hit. Um, I know that um, they have brought out the most beautiful Huda Beauty one um, which is quite expensive. I'll pop it up here. I think it's called Naughty Nudes, something like that but it's absolutely stunning so I know that that will be a massive hit with some people. If you can't afford the Huda Beauty one, they do also have like the mini palettes in Urban Decay, um, which I will pop up here, which are brand new as well. And they've got those really glittery colors, which are like so luxurious and beautiful. Also, if not, I do know as well in B&M, they are doing gift sets of the Revolution um, where YouTubers have collabed with Revolution in like for 11 pounds, which I think is absolutely insane. So that is definitely something you could get, which is absolutely amazing in the makeup brand, which is eyeshadows. But if not, if stock and fillers as well, well, adding this one in, you can get eyelashes. So every girl loves a, f a pair of eyelashes. So 100% pop in some eyelashes. You can get them for like half price in boots for like two, three pounds. Um, amazing website as well that I know called Pound Lashes. Absolutely stunning, like the most stunning eyelashes. And they're like 3D and they're a pound. So you could get them a cluster of eyelashes if they really love them and pop them in a stocking or as part of a gift, if you did get them an eyeshadow palette that was a little bit cheaper, add some eyelashes from the pound lashes and that there is literally a lovely, lovely gift. So eyelashes are definitely a winner. Also recommending lip combos. So I know that MAC do loads of lip combos of lip liners and um, lipsticks. So obviously the makeup is literally so extreme. You could go from beauty blenders to eyebrow pencils to eyelashes to eyeshadow palettes to foundation to absolutely everything. Even things like the iconic glow setting spray and all of that. That would just be so amazing. There's so many different areas. So definitely look into makeup. I find also what really helps is actually going onto websites like Cult Beauty, Beauty Bay and just having a scroll. Sometimes you you can scroll and think oh my god did not even realize like 
that was actually on the website. I also um, would 100% recommend, I know one of my friends has actually started up her own little business, um, Lip Scrubs. Such an amazing idea to like pop into a little stocking, just a little lip scrub. I remember the old days when we all went to Lush and had that bubblegum lip scrub and everyone was just literally eating it in school. Like definitely recommend a lip scrub, like that would be amazing. Another amazing thing actually um, to get is definitely things like purses and bags. I know 100% um, on Ted Baker at the moment because Ted Baker is always beautiful for their purses. They're actually 50% off at the moment on their website on all their purses. So definitely have a look. So they're usually like 85 pounds and at the moment I think they're like 50, 49 pounds or something like that, which is like crazy. So definitely have a look out there for purses and bags. You could always get ones from like River Island to do absolutely stunning bags not even just River Island, everywhere. Um, you could always go for like something like Tommy Hilfiger or Guess. Guess is absolutely beautiful, which would be 100% a lovely gift. Or a Valentino bag if they like going out loads and um, they really like going out in the evening and want something a little bit more dressy, like a little over the shoulder bag. You think over the shoulder bags, purses, card holders is another really, really good one. I absolutely love card holders. Um, I think is now like the latest craze to have a card holder. So that would be absolutely great. Also things like, yeah, so over the shoulder handbags, actual handbags, purses, card holders, um, which is amazing. Or also on that subject, um, like things for stocking fillers, you could always get like little handheld mirrors um, for people's bags, um, little lip balms. You could even get like cute, do with a cute little hamper with like for someone's bag or if you got them a bag with things like like the mirrors, the hand sanitizers, the wipes, because obviously it is Corona and I think that would be such a funny, cute little gift to have in somebody's handbag, which would be so lovely. As well as that, we all have have a lot of time on our hands at the moment um, we don't know when we're always going into the next lockdown so I also asked for a Kindle so obviously reading has been something that I've always loved and I've decided to pick it up again and having books is so sometimes can be really annoying if you want to order and you can't get the book or anything so having a Kindle is like would be so amazing as you it's just your own little library so you could get a kindle with like a case to go with the kindle or something like that would be so lovely i know that like especially um i've asked things like miss hinch's book i know that um stephanie meyer from twilight's brought out a new book like so many people are bringing out books at the moment and i just think it's a really nice way to relax and take your time off also on the subject of books, I definitely think there are some great things for positivity and there are some great books out there for positivity and women and encouraging women to feel so body positive, which is amazing. I know that Chessie King, I think her name is, um, does some absolutely amazing book so I 100% recommend getting someone to have a feel good book to make them feel positive it would be such a lovely gift to make them feel light and happy which I 100% recommend especially in these times as well as gifts like that I always think as well thinking sentimental and also things like keepsakes so um, Etsy is such an amazing website that you can get things personalised on, like you can get like um, mason jars personalised or like cups personalised or um, say a photo frame or you know when they're doing those um, pictures where they do them like on the iPad and they colour out your face and they like make it like, um, like cartoony, I'll pop a picture here so that you can see. Maybe doing something like that for someone um, would be so lovely and just so personal, I think that would be really really good and thinking about like what's in their house already to match it up with I think would be so thoughtful but also really really nice gift that someone wouldn't be expecting if you really have no idea so nice to get something like that 
Also some really more good ideas would be things like jewellery, like earrings or necklaces. You can go from places like La Visa, which have like really creative, amazing earrings and also some really stunning earrings for literally like $5.99, which is such a lovely present. Also um, definitely things like Pandora um, and Tommy Hilfiger and Thomas Sabo or Sabo or how I don't know how you say it, but loads of places do some amazing in jewellery that you could 100% get even if you see that they wear like a necklace every day maybe getting like a pendant to go on the necklace would be such a lovely idea um, so that you can say look you can change and swap this and put the pendant on I think it's just such a different idea which would be so lovely another really good idea which I is my go-to every year is always lush stuff so 100% things like bath bombs um, body bars, body butters, hair care, face masks, your whole caring, pampering kind of items. Lush is always so good as well and they definitely do do um, delivery which is amazing um, and you can literally get some absolutely amazing bath bombs from there and they always do like a Christmas range so if you wanted to do Christmas and everything's like three pounds so it's not too bad price at all which I think is amazing so Lush is always a must and they also do like those really cute gift packs so probably everybody knows what I'm on about but you know like the gift packs which I'll pop up some photos as well so definitely things like that is a, a massive, massive, massive hit. So you can always do things as well, like get candles um, and do like hair, care packages like I've seen Mrs Hinch making actually some absolutely beautiful um, little um, like she's made like these little tubes which have like hot chocolate and she's put some marshmallows in and some sugar and some hot chocolate powder and she's just tied a little like bow around it in like this little bit of cellophane you could actually create your own things she also did like cookie mix and put it in a jar and just put like a little tag on it for someone who isn't um like to like you don't want to buy them a really expensive gift maybe making your own would be such a lovely thoughtful way of giving something to something something to someone without them even realizing so that would be such a lovely gift too also pajamas pajamas is definitely a must you can go really luxury or you can literally go not luxury at all so you do things like pajamas um dressing gowns like really cute things like that um 100 would be so lovely i definitely know that you can go like victoria's secret robes or you could go the angel collection from l darby who has the most the most stunning collections ever and she literally makes it look so beautiful I literally can't cope um, and you can get like the fluffy teddy bear material loungewear is definitely definitely a must I think it's so beautiful and without a doubt you'll know that they'll be wearing them if it's someone like me anyway I will 100% be wearing it no matter what even if you don't know their size, it's fine. You can always, usually with things like pajamas and stuff, it's about a small, medium or large. And even then, with loungewear, you can always go larger than what you think they are. As like, you know, it's always better to be comfy. So getting shoes, everybody loves a new pair of trainers if you know their size. Even things from trainers to like slippers would be such a cute gift idea. Even things for like things around the house, like if you know that they've been talking about something they want for ages, like, I really wanted um, an incense burner and I've asked for incense, the one where the smoke like trickles down. I'll see if I can put up a little photo here. But things like that, even to bits like pampas grass, which is what I've got over here, like you could 100% get things like that as well, which I think is so lovely and quite a personal gift that isn't just Christmassy and can be all year round. Also another really good idea would be things like for hair care. So um, getting things like GHD straighteners, which is like quite the pricey end or like Molly Mae's um, kits where she has like the barrel curlers and like the mermaid waver. I feel like everybody loves a mermaid waver. If they haven't got one, definitely have a think and see would they like that or not. Um, definitely thinking. They do some really, really good ones as well. I know on Amazon of like Babyliss ones, which are only like £15. And I have had mine for like five years. And I know my friend Rianne actually has it now too, because I suggested it to her. And she was like, where did you get your curler from? And they are 
are like on Amazon, on Boots, and I'll pop up some photos here of like some expensive ones versus like cheaper ones. But don't just always go expensive. Cheaper ones as well are literally just as good. So 100%, that is another really, really great gift for something a little bit more as their big present. Nobody needs to know how much you paid. That could have been 150 pounds, that curler that was like 15. You never know. So definitely 100% recommend those two. Also another really good gift along the lines of the paintings is things like the Spotify. So say if your partner or somebody has um, a favorite that is like your song together, I think it obviously is such a sentimental thing. You can go on Etsy and find um, somebody who creates personalized ones, but they do like the Spotify plaques. And oh my God, I just think that was such a cute idea for somebody um, to have like your song on together and sometimes they do like the barcodes where you can like hover over it and the song plays from your phone which I think is so cute and like personalised I just absolutely love it. Also chocolate, chocolate is such a big hit definitely go for the packs of celebration pack things and like the celebrating Christmas ones like the Cadbury packs and like even if you did get them like a actual um, box like you know the the circle boxes like the tubs of chocolates everybody loves them so definitely think about chocolates definitely as well what I'm also going to mention is definitely some good shops um, at the moment I have been to a few shops as well to give me like ideas I know it's locked down and things but um, I have done a bit of browsing around I've been to two, two shops um, so in this section I'm going to be talking about shops and things that I would 100% recommend for buying gifts especially during lockdown so um, B&M 100% for stocking fillers they have some amazing packages like um like coke the coke glasses with a little co coke bottle in like a little um gift package with like a little can opener i think that's so lovely they have been doing some amazing gift packages with chocolates with perfumes with skincare with actual revolution makeup um with so many many stuff they have obviously like the Nivea packs and things like that which I think are so beautiful and lovely especially for an extra little gift so B&M is definitely a good place to go also home bargains if you want to get like little bits and bobs home bargains is actually like a really good place to go and have a little look they also do like gift care packages they also as well have loads of like um makeup bits that you can also buy like little things for like 50p like for exfoliating gloves and things like that which are so good so definitely have a look in home bargains b and b and m also garden centers like i know it sounds so stupid but like there are so many lovely gifts like special candles and incense and like they do like books in there like um i went to the cabri um cabri garden center i always want to call it cabri world and it was so lovely in there they had so much stuff and like they had like ornaments for the garden and um which you would never even think of but for th things like your nan like my nan loves ornaments in her garden and like wind chimes and things like that which is so lovely definitely think in the garden centers they have like really some lovely classic books which they've made um like as a decoration like you know when people put them on their coffee tables and they've decorated the um like the hardback covers which they would normally be like i don't know like a photo of something or like big bold writing what the book is they've just done like classic lovely like gold and black and like um all these different like silver um bookcase covers but like the pages being silver which i think is another lovely gift so there was so much stuff when i went into the garden center i was literally like oh my god for men and for women even things like cookbooks and things like that there was so much stuff in garden centers i think i forgot kind of like what was actually in them so yeah definitely 100 percent recommend garden centers for lockdown now also online um i would really recommend very.com um my mum's a very conscious online shopper but she absolutely loves very um and they do so much stuff on there jewelry and perfume and clothes and everything literally absolutely everything kindles everything on very so definitely have a look also asos um they are amazing if you type in like things like christmas gifts they do like um packages and you can and it's just just like an idea thing even if you don't actually want to get 
anything just gives you some like really good ideas i also found that um makeup sites like beauty bay and places like that have some amazing um gift sets and things on too and if you just type in your brand that you're looking for and you think oh i want to go for like charlotte tilbury on and just look on the charlotte tilbury website especially where especially as black friday's coming up have a look for the deals look for things it's so much better to get it now than to wait until christmas as things prices go ridiculously high so definitely just get things in mind definitely think looking up the websites is such a good idea because i think it just like opens your mind to different things as well even just typing in on google christmas gift ideas you never know something might pop up and you think oh my god that's the gift so that is i think that's all the website okay so that is the end of the video so that was my kind of gift ideaing for other people and kind of yourself of what you want to put for your wish list for yourself and others i really do hope you have enjoyed it i really do hope it wasn't me just literally like blabbing out because i feel like i was just blabbing so i'm really sorry if you're a bit like oh that was a bit like oh my god i'm so sorry but i just really wanted to like get out my kind of gifting ideas and just help somebody kind of gift things to others and others and also think of things for yourself so yeah that was the end of the video i have so many videos coming up in store i've literally got them ready to upload i cannot wait so please keep your eyes peeled for those videos and please like and subscribe if you like this video please comment down below your gift ideas for other people and yourself because i need more ideas like i have no idea for some people i'm like they won't want any of that and I'm like I don't know what to get like literally the stress and the drama but yeah that is absolutely everything thank you so much for watching this video I really do hope you've enjoyed and please join me soon for another video thank you very much hope you've had a wonderful day bye